Konnichiwa! Yo kaso, Dianasaur Dishes. Or hello, welcome to Dianasaur Dishes. Today we are in for a special treat, a chance to experience omakase. Omakase is Japanese for entrust. And in the world of sushi, it means letting the chef decide what you have for dinner. You can expect him or her to present you with the best of the best in both ingredients and presentation. Of course, this means it's not going to come cheap. Fortunately, my friends at Food Buzz are footing the bill, so not only do we get to experience omakase, but we get to enjoy it at Mashiko, the very first sustainable seafood sushi restaurant in Seattle. Mashiko has a small storefront in West Seattle on California Avenue, surrounded by several other restaurants and shops. But one thing that really makes it stand out is Chef Hajime Sato and his decision this year to make sustainability a focus at his restaurant. The seafood industry as it currently exists is not sustainable. That means a lot of the seafood we eat could go extinct in 30, 20, 10, or for some species maybe even 5 years. Now Hajime is more than a chef. He is both a teacher and student of sustainability. He rigorously researches seafood practices, rather than simply following an organization's guidelines. He also searches around the world for reputable sources and develops relationships with seafood sustainability experts. Then he passionately shares what he's learned with students, customers, and anyone who will listen. He's been called an elitist and stuck up, but in the opinion of this humble foodie, his ideas seem pretty common sense. Rather than expecting instant gratification and filling our bellies with rapidly dwindling specialties from the sea, just wait a few years. Let these endangered species grow and flourish. Do some research and refuse to support fishing practices that aren't sustainable. In the meantime, Hajime has found and created plenty of sustainable delights that will knock your socks off. Hajime for an evening that we will remember for the rest of our lives. Thank you foodbuzz.com for making this possible. And thank you to all of you, my readers, friends, and family, because without you, my blog wouldn't exist. Have a good night, everybody. <laughs>